Hello, it's St. Mary Magdalene, and thanks for tuning in to this week's video with me, Father Chris. What a great joy that today, May 3rd, we have 74 children making it their Holy Confirmation and Holy Communion, receiving body and blood, soul, and divinity of Jesus for the first time. Congratulations to all of our sacramental recipients and parents and sponsors and our catechists and aides and everyone who's helped get us to this day. What a beautiful celebration and a great renewal for the church. And so thank you all for your yes and for your wonderful uh, labors to help give this gift to these children. And please continue to keep them in prayer that the fruits and the gifts and the power of the Holy Spirit may imbue their lives and may guide them and may teach them and help them to know Christ, to love Christ, and to serve Christ on this life so that we can be happy with him in the next. Just what a beautiful gift truly to see so many uh, making these great sacraments. I also wanted to say thank you. A few of you have already uh, participated in our two matching gift campaigns, one for the general fund and one for the rectory. You can read about them in the bulletin and in the flock note. I will also put the information in the text of this video. But thank you so much to all those who have already donated and made contributions. Thank you to those matching the gifts. If you'd still like to, you have a few weeks, uh, several weeks to be able to make a donation just to help us out to continue to meet the day-to-day -day needs of our parish. Uh, very, um, uh, I'm always very moved and truly humbled by everyone's generosity. So thank you so much. Uh, also, as we begin this month of May, this is a month devoted to Mary. This month, we especially turn to Our Lady in the most holy and powerful rosary. So a little challenge for each of us, just to receive many of the Lord's blessings mediated through our Blessed Mother and bestowed so lavishly through Mary and her intercession. Let's pray the rosary. Pray the rosary for our needs, for the needs of the church, for the needs of our nation, and for the needs of our world. Just asking the Blessed Mother to help us all come to know Christ and to love Christ and to serve Christ. And just what a beautiful gift and powerful tool we have in this month of May, this month devoted to the Most Holy Rosary. We also begin graduation season. So, boy, there's so much happening. Congratulations to all of our graduates. What wonderful achievements and accomplishments. You should be proud of yourselves for that, for the hard work and the fruit of your labors. So, again, a beautiful gift. So much happening in this great month. Um, and I just wanted to share those thoughts. Again, pray for all of those making sacraments today, May 3rd, or who did make their sacraments. Uh, thank you to all of our donors and those wanting to make donations to our matching gifts. Thank you. I'm very much moved by that. The information is in the flock note, in the bulletin, and in the text below, in the video description. Uh, and thank you so much for that. There'll be several more weeks to make that donation. Uh, May, the month of Mary, devoted to Our Lady and the Most Holy Rosary. And of course, graduates, congratulations for the beautiful gift Let's pray. Let's ask the Lord to pour out many blessings upon us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Father, we thank you and praise you for everything you give to us. We thank you for the wonderful joy of the sacraments, the confirmation, confession, communion, the Mass, and the wonderful ability to live and to practice our faith, to have these privileged encounters with you in these avenues of grace, these visible signs your invisible grace at work in our hearts, minds, and souls. Pray that all those who've made their sacraments may, can, may receive a wonderful and abundant outpouring of grace and of gifts and fruits and that the Holy Spirit may be made manifest in their life. May Our Lady in a very special way intercede for them and for all of us during this month of May, this month devoted to Mary. May she help us to live as disciples of Christ to know him, to love him, and to serve him. We entrust ourselves to you through the intercession of our Blessed Mother. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. St. Mary Magdalene, pray for us. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Have a great week, and I will see you on Sunday.